What's up guys, my name is ESO and welcome to the channel. In this video I'm going to be showing you two hidden powers that give you some rather useful effects and buff that most people don't actually know about. You can get them really easily too, even at level 1. Anyway, let's start off with my favourite of the two. For this hidden effect, you must travel up the 7,000 steps of the Throat of the World, the tallest mountain in Skyrim. Start off at Iverstead, just here on the map. You must now read all the stone plaques that look like this one on the way up the mountain. Each plaque tells you a little bit of lore about the way of the voice and the dragonborn. There are 10 of these plaques in total, you must read them all. Despite being the tallest mountain in Skyrim, it only takes you about 5 minutes to do this. You'll find the last plaque on the doorstep of Hythrothgar. After activating the 10th plaque, you'll get the special power called Voice of the Sky. This is something of an easter egg power, a little reward for actually reading all the plaques. Having this effect means that animals will neither attack you, nor will they flee from you for a whole 24 hours. That's in real time. So for example if you're hunting you can just walk right up to a bear or a saber cat that would usually attack you, and then just kill it. Even when you attack it it won't run away. This makes hunting a lot faster, and you can use those materials to sell or craft from. It's a good idea to get this at the start of the game, because you won't get killed by random roaming bears, or even saber cats. It will only take you about 5 minutes to do, and it will last a whole day of playtime, which is a very long time. Now for the last power, which is probably more well known, but still underrated. A lot of people don't take full advantage of this. You may have noticed that in Skyrim there are quite a lot of beggars. They always ask you for a single gold coin. You might have done so already, but if you give them a gold coin, you'll get a hidden power called the Gift of Charity. Divines bless your kind heart. The divine smile on a charitable. This buff boosts your speech skill by 10 points for one hour. So why is this so useful? Well besides having a higher chance to persuade or bribe people, don't forget merchants live in the city, so you can just go and get the gift of charity perk from the closest beggar, and then go and sell your loot that you just got from questing. Your speech skill affects the prices that you can sell your items for. This means that by spending one gold coin to get the buff, you can get much more gold just by selling your items. It works the same way for buying things too, so I recommend finding a beggar before buying or selling anything. I hope you guys found this video helpful. You might like to subscribe to the channel for more guides on Skyrim like this one. Or you can just watch my live Let's Plays on Twitch, where you can talk to me and ask me questions. Just check out the links in the description. Thanks for watching guys, make sure you leave a like if this helped you and I'll see you in the next video.